and welcome back for the review section of Paradise in Peril. Now to give you a quick summary, this article, let's say this unit, is about the island of Mauritius and a ship that was stranded and a lot of oil was just leaking out of it. And this is a disaster for the natural wildlife of this beautiful, beautiful island. So obviously when this happened, they appealed for international aid and specialists from Japan and France and the United Nations were sent to help with this disaster. They managed to siphon 3,000 tons of oil. But unfortunately, there were still a thousand tons, you know, wow. that like the thousand ton they couldn't siphon. And that is still also a big, big, big problem, um, which is sad for a small little island like Mauritius. Appeal. Appeal. Siphon. Siphon. What do you work? Do you coast? Guards do, in hmm. your opinion. Well, I have limited knowledge of what Coast Guards do. Uh, <laughs> and most Americans kind of make a joke that Coast Guard is kind of the uh, lazier, weaker military branch in America because oh, it's part of the military. Um, but they essentially guard the coast, kind of, you know, what the name suggests. Yes, uh, yes. But what they actually do is, I know in Texas area, the Gulf of Mexico, they do a lot of. Um, drug protection for like drug um, smuggling right they try to catch the submarines and boats yes. uh and, or planes they they watch the coast area and obviously they help with rescuing and it's way more intense especially i believe in the like atlantic region because yes. uh, the the swells or the waves get much bigger it, the water is much colder mm. and around alaska area um you know, it's pretty intense for the Coast Guard. Mm. Uh, Would this type of job appeal to you? Would you enjoy doing it? You know, I had actually, at that time, I was already interested in going into the military, oh. but I was an avid swimmer at that time. Mm. And I thought, well, what if I did this? You know, mm. but it would be quite an extreme lifestyle. I think um, so. Extreme for the family environment. Mm. So I know that those family members struggle. Mm. Uh, and it's quite a hard job. It requires a lot of sacrifice, mm. a lot of risk. Hmm. And so after thinking much more about it and talking to my father, I decided I wouldn't even go that direction. Right, right. <laughs> like you said, it is a lot of sacrifice and I think it's hard on the family too, mm -hmm. not just on the individual. Yes, right. Yes. But they do play a very important role. Yeah, uh, yeah, I do. You know, and how about in South Africa? Do you have like a Coast Guard or uh, Honestly something speaking, similar? Honestly speaking, I have no idea. But I suppose <laughs> we do. We need it, right? They have to save people. Um, right. uh, the best, you know, the worst I can do when it comes to that is I know we have lifeguards. Because <laughs> I'm on the beach. I'm not in the ocean. Yeah. I love the sea. I'm there in the little waves splashing around. Mm -hmm. But um, obviously, I'm sure we do. They just aren't as prominent. That is it for this unit. Please join us again next time.